everybody. Welcome to Kotaku Bonsai. This is Cindy. I just wanted to provide a short follow-up to our lanternfly situation. So um, earlier you had seen me post that, um, you know, Dave and I have been doing a lot of taping. Uh, that continued throughout the summer and we had a lot of good results with that. We um, really stayed on top of it, retaped every few days, and found that it was actually catching the adult lantern flies as well as the smaller nymphs. So uh, we, we did catch a lot of them. Um, however, we still went ahead and had the arborist come out and the company came out about a week and a half ago and they went ahead and soaked our really tall maple trees. Um, like I said before, we have four very mature, probably 60 feet tall trees in our yard. And those have been the ones that have been super problematic for us. So they came out, it didn't take long. They went around, soaked the trunks of our trees. And, you know, not even an hour later when I walked out, there were a lot of lantern flies falling off the tree. You could tell they had bit the tree because their wings were opened up and they were just kind of hanging out and they would kind of repel off and ended up in the yard. So very happy with that. Um, glad that we did it. I think that is really going to just top off all the efforts that we had made, you know, since the springtime. Um, now this afternoon I did go walk around and take a look at them just to kind of see where we're at at this point. Like I said, we're about a week and a half out from, from that spraying happening. And I, I did see, you know, maybe a dozen or so lanternflies on each tree. However, they're small. So my theory is that these are just still juveniles and once they're fully mature, that's when they start feeding and bite the trees. So like I said, they're, they're kind of on the small side, about half the size of, of those, you know, mature adults. So I'm thinking they haven't actually bitten the trees yet and that's why they're kind of hanging out there. So what I'm hoping to see over the next few days and weeks is that as they fully mature and start to try to feed, we're going to see them falling off the trees as well. Um, you know, still comparatively, we are nowhere close to where we were the year before. Um, it was just awful at this point in the summer. Our trees were completely filled. They're, they were jumping all over us. Right now, we, you know, we can go out on the deck and we don't see any. We, we can be around the pool. We see one or two here or there, but nothing like we have ex experienced in the past. So I'm really, really hopeful that all of these efforts have, have, have gotten the infestation under control. Um, Hopefully you guys are, are having some good results too. Um, you know, let us know how things are going where you're at. We'd love to hear from you. And like always, if, if you're enjoying hearing these updates and seeing our videos, just click that like and subscribe. Thanks.